in addition to this uh, this Ford power wagon style you know suburban style truck right here found this one located right across the lane from the SLS fabrication I guess it's for sale also there's a Ford cab over F5 This was adapted from the other F chassis of the early of the early 50s and late 40s. This is 1948. See, really, you see, what they did was they used the same cab, but they they cut off the tip of the nose for the engine, used bigger flares because it's a medium duty truck, and then attached it to a larger suspension, larger frame. And this one here, it's got a front drive shaft too. Even though this does not look original, it's probably been built on or something. What was it say here? The chassis is a 1980 C70, 2008 F450 hybrid. So, the chassis comes from a 1980 Chevrolet, medium duty, C70 and then a Ford Super Duty 2008 because he didn't tell you what part though so it's got a Detroit 453 custom intercooler original cab yeah man let's see here it's, it's got the old style phone number it's got a steak bed. This is great. So he entered. He did He entered himself into the show. This is looking good. Got the tail lights he has here. Well, he could have made bigger tail lights for this thing. Cause he's got these two little cherries here, and then he's got these ambers here. The square Jeep style myself. But okay. Oh. Yeah, that's impressive, isn't it? There's some more stuff out here. I'm going to concentrate because it's getting dark. I'm only going to concentrate on the dynamite stuff. And then tomorrow morning, when it's more daylight, when there's daylight and more of it, then I can get the miscellaneous stuff. There's a A-team van over there with a General Lee on the tail, on a trailer. I don't have time to get to that, but there's some more older forts here I want to capture.